Hello everyone and welcome to Outfus Plays Stoneblock. It is Feed the Beast Presents Stoneblock 2. Can you see my cursor? You can. I'm going to just start this while I talk to you. Um, I'm going to apologise up front because, uh, as you may know from my... Goodness me. Uh, Cataclysm series, my microphone is right in front of my keyboard and there's going to be a lot of typing in this game. <laughs> so, what I'm very much expecting to happen is that I whack the microphone all the time whilst trying to look past it and, and type correctly without being a complete moron, although that's going to happen too. Uh, how long does it take to build a terrain that is completely solid stone? Not that long, I would wager. I am using the Fax Texture Pack, which means I should probably leave a link in the description. If I haven't done that, feel free to yell at me in the comments and I will go, oh yeah, but it will be too late by then and then there'll be lawsuits and then I'll be demonetized and then I'll have to stop making videos. Not that I make any money from the videos, so I'm going to still make the videos anyway, but thanks for watching. Come on, game. I've got, I can't fill up this much dead air, so just get on with it. Right, so stone block. Is this my... Did I just install? What did I just use? Hello? I've got a pet rock. Hi. Um, this is, this is new. <laughs> I had a thing in my... Oh, that was my pet rock. I used it and now I've got a pet rock. That's cute! Find and mine stonium ore. So I've got stonium. Uh, this is not the same as the stone block that I played recently, although, this being said, we do have a quest book. This looks new. I like this. Building block of life. Gather stone pebbles. So we know... I don't know if you've seen someone play this before. It's quite a reasonably old... Ah, uh, challenge map thingy, and the idea is that you punch this stone with an empty hand and you drop pebbles, whereas... Oh! Got that. Uh, you punch the pebbles, you punch the stone, you get the pebbles, you turn the pebbles into things, and you build up from there. We are going to try and make this look cool. So, starting out, I expect there to be a decent amount of um, just staring at me hitting stone. So, I will try and cut out Anything that's particularly boring, maybe. You are completely quest nice. Uh, but uh, who's who's to decide what is boring and what is not? So, random reward. This is very new. This is not the stone book. Uh, stone book? This is not the stone block quest book that I'm used to. Random reward. We get an auto... Ah, oh, that's really good. Does this require power? Yeah, I can burn it. <laughs> oh, we've got Thorncraft in here. That's amazing. So what? what how do you work? Looks like any power of some description. It's from X Nihilo, so uh, let's have a look at X space Nihilo. At, at Nihilo. Where's my at Nihilo? Told you, I'm gonna get it wrong a lot. Um, grinder whip does nothing yet. Okay. Stone axle, water wheel. I'm guessing these all stick together. That would make some sense, right? Um, the stone axle is a bunch of stone stuff. X Nihilo, Buildcraft. Stone gear. No, where's my stone gear? No recipe for this. Which one of these has a recipe? That one does. So we can make one just out of stone. So we're going to have to basically stick together a lot of this stone uh, that we've got dropping from punching stone, turn it into cobblestone, and from thence, which, okay, I understand that the word thence already has the word from in it. You don't need to tell me how to grammar. Okay, just assume that whenever I make a grammatical mistake, I did it on purpose, and it was for poetic or comedic effect. Even if it's not poetic or funny, it's a decent assumption, and then uh, you don't need to leave a comment. So I'm going to keep punching, keep punching, and after we've done this, so what we next do, what we next do is we make cobblestone. Stone Age. <laughs> uh, this, by the way, will tell us what to do. So I've made cobblestone. You need to make 12 of them. Oh. I see. That may be a thing that you can do rather than the thing that I am given the option to do. This is a. I've never seen this quest book in this style before. The version I'm playing on my laptop, which can barely run this, I'm guessing is uh, an earlier version of the Stone Block Pack. Possibly. I'm pretty sure it's still Stone Block Two. So this must be Stone Block Two updated for Super version. But I'm really liking the. It's entirely possible. Uh, make no mistake that I am unaware that it is Fax doing that, but I don't think it is. Um, yeah, so, cool. We're just going to punch all these until we've got... Uh, is that enough yet? I think so. That's 13. That's enough. That's enough. We are going to get a random reward. Craft a cobblestone chest. And craft a stone craft. So we do want to make the crafting table first. Because uh, that will pave the way to literally everything else. Where did my stone go? In my inventory. Um, 
including a stone hammer, which we are going to need. Please put that there. Uh, to turn stone into everything else. Oh, that's a task. There's tasks and quests. Interesting. We need to make dirt. Uh, right, there's... Oh, this is new. I like this. Storage, chickens, fluid cows, mystical agriculture. So we're going to end up going through a lot of this. What is in here? Nice. So let's have... Uh, I'm wondering how much these are gated at foam craft. Enter so we can scroll. And... I'm wondering if it's literally just a case of making Sailor's Mondays and sprinkling it on a thing. Previous crystals, yeah, that's the same. Possible that that's going to be easy to get into, but it may be that it advances very uh, difficultly afterwards. So I'm going to start uh, turning the stone into cobblestone. One of the first things you want to do in this uh, pack here is to craft the stone hammer just as I did. You can start using it to turn this directly into cobblestone instead of sort of hoping for the best that each of your uh, punching efforts resolves into four pieces of stone chips and then you can only make one couple so you know not every single stone turns into a piece of cobblestone if you use your fists which is expected because that's how minecraft works I punch all this and then we can start making dirt uh, it's going to be gravel first and then dirt but we do have vein miner or i think at least ore excavator something like that so if we do dun 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 and then over it has in that case what is controls uh x uh, graph so what is morph this is a thing that what <laughs> this is the thing that bothers me is that in minecraft for some reason even though i can type an apostrophe and a graph accent separately in the thingy it believes that they are the same thing in game so if i'm trying to find for example why, by the way, options? Uh, mod op I'm sure I saw mod options. Because um, if I got like apostrophe, nothing is on apostrophe. Nothing is on graph. Excavate is on graph. So for some reason, <sighs> I'm going to put you on apostrophe. No, because I want to press apostrophe just now. The conflicts. Semicolon. When I, uh, that's fine. When I pressed apostrophe just now, it said graph. And I was like, no, not graph. I want apostrophe and graph to be different things. So I can type them separately, but I can't use them separately, which is very stressful. Uh, please this. Now we have dirt. How much dirt do we need? Dirtmouth. Where's that? Somewhere near Essex, no doubt. Random reward. Basic flux storage. Interesting. Stores energy in the flux. Yeah, okay. That is from flux networks. We have got a long way to go before we're into flux networks. I'm just going to put that down for now. I'm hoping I can pick that up again. Um, curse me, maybe I can't. Maybe we should have just made a chest. Let's make a chest. Uh, that's a furnace, but I do want one. Chest. Stone chest. Stone chest. No. Cobblestone chest. Cobblestone part. Okay. Easy mode. Excuse me. Four. My mistake. I can have two. Even better. That actually gets us a little bit further than we had before. Get rid of all that. I will keep this. Now that you see the trouble. <laughs> Without a. Um, I've been able to use a semicolon key for the quest book. I now don't have a quest book button. So I have to keep the quest book on me, which is a pain in the bother. Also, we want to sift stuff, so now we need to make a sieve. Crooked. Craft stone crook. Very well. I'm wondering if we get a reward for any of these that would be slightly more useful. Oh, we need more stone. Well, it's lucky there's plenty of it. We're going to try and make this base look nice. It's dead easy to just make these boxes repeatedly, which honestly can look quite nice if you uh, do it right, but we're going to try and make it a little bit... More extravagant, we're stuck in this stone tomb for the rest of forever, so we might as well make the most of it. And eventually, of course, we'll be uh, travelling to different dimensions anyway, so really... Who's whinging? Not me. Crook. Stone crook. 
Oh, my mistake. You see, this is what happens when you assume. You know, make an ass out of yourself. Luckily, four in the corner. Grand, give me that stone crook. There we go. Done it. Next. Please give me something easy. Spawner changer. Spawner changer. Actually, additions. Spawner changer. Spawner changer. Changes spawners. I, I don't know. Oh, I'm guessing then maybe it's uh, if you find a spawner in the world, which we're not going to do because there's no dungeons or anything in this world. If you were to find one, you could probably just change the, the mob that's in it. Maybe you have to pick up a mob and tell it to spawn. Oh, that seems pretty good, actually. Can you craft a spawner? Yes, with a dragon egg. <laughs> Got a long way to go before we're doing that, boys. Long way to go, indeed. Uh, gather wood. Task 16 of any wood. Use the dirt and saplings to make a tree farm to gather wood. Now, I believe there's a way of getting saplings with dirt without... Do you hit it with the crook? Yes. Right, good. So if you hit the crook, the dirt with the crook, you get a sapling. In this case, we've got an oak sapling, and we'll work at it. To work it, maybe. Yeah. Uh, and I'm going to have to use this, because I'm, uh, I'm going to Google between this episode and the next one to see if there's a way that I can... Um, what am I trying to say? I want to be able to um, turn off the grav key for morph. I'm not sure if I'm... Then again, morph is pretty cool. Why is there a bright light behind me? The flipping place across the way. Oh, I've got uh, dirt now. Oh, I used on my dirt. What a monster. What a noob. What a fool. <laughs> Philistine. Put these in here. I don't need these. Oh, I'm going to need one of them. Um, and these. More stone, please. Okay, fine. Um, use the wood to reach stone. We are getting somewhere. We are no longer just a fist in a box. We are a fist in a box with a piece of wood. Much better, I think you would agree. Uh, at some point, we're just going to have to destroy the lovely shape that I've made this room. But for now, I'm reluctant to do so. Quite reluctant, indeed. Quickly. And our little uh, friend there. Why can I hit you? Nothing. Sorry, Pet Rock. I just wanted to know. Why have you got a Christmas hat on, by the way? Have you spawned with a hat? So if I kill you, I get the hat. But of course, I, I, I can't. So you don't. La 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 la. This bit is not the most entertaining, I understand. But I mean, we've got big plans for this place. And I'm always going to look like me. And I think we can, you know, we can really make this place at home. If we, Get ourselves a home base. Not sponsored. Hashtag not sponsored. Hashtag don't at me. More dirt, please. I needed at least one dirt because I accidentally vein mined the dirt that was growing my tree. Um, we should... We're just going to need to keep doing this over and over again anyway. I don't think there's a way of getting... Oh, you've done it again. I thought that would not catch it. That's upsetting. Let's have a look at my tasks. Uh, give me that. 16. 16 of any wood. Start making more space for ourselves, I guess. I like the idea of having little pillars every now and then, so I'm going to sort of keep these in. If you don't very much mind. We should probably uh, smelt up some of this wood to make charcoal so that we can start having maybe a, a generator or something. I'd like to get into power very early. I think that's going to be a good way to go. The reason I think that is that the alternative is to not get power very early. Need to get power anyway, and then we can't get power because it's too much effort and I can't be bothered. I mean, oh, we've got plenty of those. Let's not do that. More than plenty of those. Do, do, do. Which means we can probably make plenty of hammers. I'm just going to leave these in here for now. Get rid of the rest of this. I'm going to start making the dirt that we really need to not be gone because I keep accidentally begonning it. Honestly, it's not like we're going to be not making a whole bunch more dirt. Anyway, I'm hiccuping because I drank my tea really quickly. <laughs> it's bad for you to do that sort of thing, okay? It's not bad for you. It's not, it's not going to... It's not like eating chewing gum is going to twist itself around your inside sort of bad for you. It's just um, it makes you hiccup, which is a bad thing. So obviously it's bad for you. Mm. Stop pressing that button. Because we're going to fix it, and then I'm going to be pressing that button on purpose again. 
This does get faster. There is a way of uh, improving the speed at which you melt these blocks down, by which I mean that poetically in the sense of uh, break them down. Because if you craft a compressed hammer, you can smash up compressed blocks. But I currently, I probably could actually create nine hammers. I mean, I certainly have the material around me to do so. It's just whether I'm willing to go to the effort of digging all that out right now when all I really need is... Oh, I should be uh, growing this, by the way. Don't forget to grow it, because that's the next quest. I've jumped ahead in the quest book, you see, uh, to... I don't even know if it exists anymore, actually. They might have taken out that quest, so maybe I should stop being a pest and just start dig, dig, digging. There was a quest in the previous version where you had to get four of each sapling type. And then, of course, I had four of each sapling type for the rest of my life. And nothing to do with it. So, kind of glad they've got rid of that, if indeed they have. Or maybe it's a later quest and I can't see it. Either way, don't throw your hammer on the ground, you need that. Uh, either way, we're not doing it now. So, we'll plant this dirt and turn it into bees. I'm going to keep doing oak, because then it'll stack in my inventory. I don't really fancy... Um, I don't really fancy the alternative, which is having a load of different types of wood for no specific necessary reason, I guess. Uh, just nine. Okay. I don't mind it. Uh, twerk, 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 twerk. Well done, me. 16, please. I wish these trees would grow a little bit bigger. It's just costing me time. Why are you not sparking? There we go. Go away, pet rock. Oh, he did. Oh, I feel bad now. Hey, what's that? Hang on. You got a pet rock delivered. Nice. Craft, craft an order form so you can get a pet rock. You got a pet rock delivered. Pet rock warranty void. You somehow damaged your pet rock. This voids its warranty. Find and mine stonium ore. Right? Why? I. Just... <laughs> It's beyond me. I don't know what's happening. This game has changed too much. Required by basic... Okay, that's the next set of these. Blank barrel upgrade small. What? Is that like separate... What? Why is... What colour is that? Why is this a different background colour? Seen that? Oh, does this mean that I've unlocked the ability to do that quest? Guess it does. So I can make this if I want to, a basic draw. Uh, it might as well, but we should probably follow this quest line a bit as well. I don't really care about tinkering, but we can get some silk from silkworms. Go, move. Just by uh, twerking a little bit more. And, oh, my mistake. Inferior essence. I accidentally killed my pet rock by growing a tree on it. In case you were wondering what just happened, and I got inferior essence from doing so, which is... Q, I guess. Item magnet pulls item and XP every 100 ticks. On by default, by. So that's uh, 100 ticks is 5 seconds. So every 5 seconds, this is going to just sort of pull things towards it, including me. Doesn't seem like it includes me. What if I do this? I do this. That seems terrible. I was hoping it would at least deposit it in the chest. Yeah, no. Uh, no, thank you. Oh, my God. Pickaxe. Whatever. <laughs> I'm not into this. Let us punch this tree, and it's been 20 minutes of me punching trees so far, so I hope thou art entertained. Um, we are going for silk. Right. Remember that. I do get distracted easily. That's what happens when you might have ADD, but who knows. So then we, what we do is this. We use the stone crook to hit these, which turns into silkworms. Hooray! Then you punch the tree down. Hooray! And then you'd grow another tree and twerk it. Twerk it, baby. Twerk it, twerk it. And then you put the silkworm in the leaves. Grow! Grow, I beseech thee. Let me out. I'm more beseeching you that you let me out than that you grow. That's cool. Don't use all your silkworms because you might want to do this again. We're not going to necessarily be able to create a vast amount of string for a while. So um, be wary of that. We should place our furnace, start making some charcoal, like this. 
Ooh, light. That's nice. Um, this place is dingy, if I'm being honest. So, let's do something else. Let's improve it. Um, well, obviously, the first thing we're going to do to improve it is to uh, keep some of this wood so that we can make sticks. Get rid of it. Some sticks. I could probably make stone torches, but I'm not going to. So, don't at me. Maybe stone torches would be cooler. One in the middle of each of these. Get the gun. Excuse me. And here. See, it's looking more homely already. Can we burn this torch? Not that torch. This torch. The MC9, it does. Uh, it has some uses if we get into Thorncraft, which we should do because Thorncraft is cool as all heck. Are you done yet? Yes. So now we should be able to do this. Get a whole bunch of string. Perfect. 51 string from that. That was really good, actually. Random reward, a generator. Oh, thank you. That's exactly what we wanted to get, get started early. It's got EMC as well. I'm so looking forward to this because, of course, we have um, equivalent exchange or the, the new version of Project E. It's been a long time since I played with Equivalent Exchange, and obviously I've never done it on camera because it's my first Minecraft episode ever, so welcome, welcome, one and all. Uh, it's going to be grand. We're going to make this place into a literal... I was going to say fortress, and then I thought about it, and kind of the principle behind a fortress is nothing can get in. <laughs> or probably out, as the case may be in this situation. Yeah, but it's going to be a palace. It's going to be a grandeur. It's going to be... This is going to be the ante room. That seems good. And then we can open this out into sort of a big hallway. Let's try something like that. Maybe a, a ballroom or something. We can have a gantry around the top, some grand stairs in the middle, and a chandelier in the ceiling. Oh, yeah. And we can go for a little dance with all the creepers that spawn in here. Why are people opening my door behind me without permission? No one said, don't need permission. Excuse me. Ah, it's bright. I objected before it happened. But I was right, in my defense. It was right. Don't need this, don't need this. What is our next quest, mine Fiora? My liege. Mining. Visit mining dimension. The overworld has no ores. It is entirely made of stone. The only way to find ores is to dig your way up to the top of the overworld and be teleported to the mining dimension that is full of ores. See J-E-Y to find the biological. That's new. Previously, the mining dimension was a place you basically couldn't get to for love nor money. Can you make a stone? Okay. This is a good start. At least we can get rid of this useless thing. Put it in here. Put all this in here. Maybe you'll think of me. Uh, at least we can go faster now. And therefore, we should probably have some sort of... Well, if that's the way into the mining dimension, then th that should be the way into this room, right? So let's make a sort of a mining... Well, let's make a mine, except it goes upwards instead of downwards, which makes... We are basically dwarves now. We are living underground, deep in the stone, and we should do our level best to dig out uh, a suitably grand cavern for the, the glory of all dwarves everywhere. So... I do really, really want a way of digging a 3x3. Three three. What's involved in making a drill? Is that the basicest drill? This is not really telling me which drill is which. Crystal flux. I mean, that's, that's a, this is a drill with die, which is Diamantine crystals, drill core. Where do these come from? Diamantine. Chickens. Atomic reconstruction. Actually, additions manual. What is this? The actual atomic reconstruction is used to craft. Cr oh, okay. So we need to create the atomic reconstructor, which is a buzzy thing. A diamond turns into a diamantine crystal. Uh, can I sieve this? No, but I can buy it from a villager. I can find a village. <laughs> and then you can make a chicken out of it. So you can create it uh, once you've got one. So there is a way to go, but I don't think it's going to be the easiest way of getting the drill. 
Um, why are these all just colored drills? Also, why don't you just say is, and this is just basic coils, which is Restonia, which is, I'm guessing another, yeah, we need an atomic reconstructor very much so. And I'm guessing crystal flux is essentially a redstone flux, except, yeah, that's RF. What's CF? Don't know. I should probably have a look at, because I couldn't help but notice that this is actually additions, and so is the Atomic Reconstructor. Yeah, so maybe it's the Atomic, maybe it's the actually additions equivalent of RF, and it's presumably a conversion or it just works directly, I don't know. But we shall find out, we might as well go digging upwards. Oh, this being said, Another thing we can do is get working on tinkers because that is the other direction that this quest book goes in, which is down here. The thing about tinkers is that we can, um, create things that are going to make it a lot easier to mine, but then we have to find the materials with which to make the things to mine. Now classic, I'm believing this is basically the, we know this, how this works. I mean, you sift the dirt and gravel that you get from mining all this stuff out, which we have plenty, so we might as well start digging up, actually, because we're going to have to get this stone anyway, one way or another. In order to get um, tinkers going properly, we're going to need a tool forge, uh, a, a, a smeltery. In order to get a smeltery, we need gravel and clay. In order to get clay, we need dust, and in order to get dust, you have to smash the stuff even harder than we already are. So we're going to need a lot of stone in order to make enough um, hammers to get through all the other stone that we're going to have to smash into dust eventually. And of course, we're going to have to sieve a whole bunch of stuff in order to get other other stuff. So I'm going to mine this upwards like this. I don't like the fact that this just goes directly into here. Uh, I guess I'm okay with it. Maybe we should curve this. That might work. Every so often we should just have a little antechamber. We could have a rest stop. We could have a mine unit, like a, a minecart unit. Ooh. What do you think? We could have like, um. every so often, like every, well, we, we're gonna want stairs. Maybe we could make it like a bit shallower. Cause I've never done this before. I always do this 45 degree mining and it is really, claustrophobic don't you think whereas we should sort of do a 25 and a half 22 and a half degree mining sort of thing right so we do two now this is going to be wrong but we can fill it in we can just pretend okay let's just pretend we didn't do it wrong in the first place um and we can replace this with like a wooden beam yeah let's do that i i recognize that i have broken my torching system here Let's just do this. Uh, we should press F7 to check that nothing's going to... Oh, I see, everything's going to kill us and die. Um, fine. I like this aesthetic. So I've been doing this previously, and it should be just enough. Obviously, that didn't work. To have... Well, let's do this. Is that... <laughs> At least we know how to have a pedestal. Well, that didn't make a difference. Let's give me that back. Give me that. On these. Yes. Seems correct. Let's do this, and then something like this. No. <laughs> I haven't got a wrench, so I can't rotate it. I am fully aware that I just placed that wrongly. Don't need to explain, but thank you for your concern, quite honestly. Uh, I'm glad that that came away. No tool. Fine. Right, everything can go in here. We don't need this. We don't need this. <sighs> we don't really need that. We don't need that. All we need is this and this. That's where... I always have the pickaxe on three, and that's quite rare, I've noticed. Most people prefer to seem, to, seem to prefer to have it on two or something similar, but... I have it on three for reasons, and the reasons being... Uh, I just always used to play Minecraft that way. I had um, sword on one, but then I'd have a bow on two. I preferred a bow. So I would. <laughs> and um, 
I don't prefer a bow anymore, but it means that I'm used to just pressing 3 if I want to start mining. That was a long time ago. I've had this game since sort of pre-alpha, right? No, not pre-alpha. I, I played around with the in-dev version when you could pay for it. Uh, when you could pay for the full game. Quote unquote full, but it must have been like 1.1 or 1.2 that I bought this game in. So it's been some time for sure. Also, we should stagger this. That would make for good aesthetic. <laughs> aesthetic, sir. As a word, I will thank you not to mock. Uh, so then we got this one, and then our axe breaks. I guess the one good thing about yep yeah, uh, having a tinker's axe to start off with is that we can repair it without using a whole bunch more wood, um, which is something I'm going to be interested in because I would rather use tinkers to create a. Uh, a grindstone every now and then like I could have an inventory full of grindstones and just make my way all the way to the top uh, which would be preferable over just faffing around coming all the way back down again or taking a, a bunch of wood and a crafting table with me which is the alternative and I'm not into that so what I'm going to do is I'm going to in between episodes I'm going to dig up there a little bit more I'm going to keep putting torches down because I don't want things to attack me yeah, that seems nice. We should make this symmetrical. There's no reason not to. There's plenty of stone. We don't have that much um, coal, charcoal, but we can make plenty more. I mean, I just made a whole bunch more. I mean, I've already accelerated charcoal production by letting me do eight more pieces of wood. Come on. Grow! It's from that. So, uh... Let's mine out eight more pieces of wood. Then we've got enough, and I'm gonna in the next episode we'll make a start on tinkers so that we have, as mentioned, a um, slightly more mm, reusable mining system by which I mean I can repair my pickaxe more easily. And we'll see what's next. So thank you for watching this episode. I hope that you've enjoyed it. I hope that you will continue to watch. Uh, and yeah, in the next episode we're gonna just work through the quest book that little bit more and make a start on Tinkers. So I look forward to seeing you then, and until then, I will see you.